Finjun Holdings, ticker symbol is FNJN. Uh, Finjun has now a 20 year history of developing and selling into the marketplace cybersecurity related products. Uh, it began in the mid 90s before the internet uh, was effectively around and viruses were running rampant. And we developed effectively behavior-based threat detection. So if you think about the security that's on PCs today, that runs in server rooms, or that you may use on a mobile device, uh, a lot of that technology was actually pioneered at Finjin. I mentioned 20 years of history. There's been some transitions. Um, we originally built software and hardware and sold that. We started licensing our patent portfolio around the 2005 timeframe. And in this period of transition, we have now reemerged as a technology business. And really in, in kind of two ways. Um, one, returning back to the original technology that was developed, which is proactive, behavior-based security scanning uh, into a mobile device application. So we build mobile security products as well as recently launching a cybersecurity advisory services firm, which is a consulting uh, services business that really is intended to help companies understand what the risks are, the cyber-related risks to their businesses, um, and also to help their boards better understand how to mitigate those risks. So we've launched those two businesses within the last year. There's a lot of insight that you can have about a market and where it's growing. So some look at the cybersecurity market today and say, wow, it's really, it's really moving quickly and it's full of transition. And for the companies that have been around like Finjun for, for 15 or 20 years even, you actually have the benefit of history. You have the benefit of being able to watch almost in slow motion the progression of how technology has really moved to meet the new threats and demands. And that puts us in a unique position to make observations and to use those observations to decide where we make investments in developing new technology. So in the cybersecurity segment, the most exciting area, at least in our opinion, is mobile security. The reality is that you just don't have an appreciation for how much of your personal data you're actually pushing out over the internet for anyone to capture. And that mobile devices just don't have the same access to security that a workplace PC or a home computer might have. So what this represents is an opportunity for Finjun to bring technology that it developed and patented and move that now into the mobile platform so that consumers can have greater control over that information. There are two aspects to Finjun's business I think that are important for shareholders to appreciate. The first is uh, somewhat lumpy and unpredictable revenues that come from our licensing business. They tend to come in million and five million dollar chunks, um, but you get, make it two in one quarter and none the next. Uh, and then what we're now moving towards is diversifying our revenues and having more predictable and forecastable and scalable growth model. And that would be in our services business and in our mobile security business. So over time, I would look to see that you'll see more forecast and predictability in those two lines of business. And you'll still have sort of these windfall income events that would, would come from our licensing side.